Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video. And today we're talking about iOS 14 setups. It's been a while. We didn't talk about setups on iOS 14, which have been a big thing since the release of iOS 14. Now, of course, having a setup is great and all that, but having redirects banners every time you open an app, that's of course very, very annoying. So in this video, I will show you guys how to get rid of banners, get rid of labels and redirections on your setup on iOS 14. All right, the process is fairly simple. You just need to follow a few simple steps. Now, the first thing you wanna do is open the shortcuts app. When, once you're on the shortcuts app, you go to the automations and here we'll need to create two different automations, which will basically prevent the banners from showing up on your apps and also the redirections that you get on iOS 14. So the first one create right here and go to app. Now, when you go to app, you will have to choose here and you will have a list of your apps. Now you will have to choose all of the apps here or just the apps for which you want to create custom icons. Now, of course, if you don't have all of your apps on the home screen, you just have a few of them. You don't need to actually select all of the apps. You can just go ahead and just select the apps in which for which, of course, you want to create actual icons, custom icons. You can even search here so I can search for like Instagram or, or anything I want. And of course, then go ahead and just create like custom icons for those apps. So here, of course, you can just go ahead and just quickly like this, select all of your apps. And once you're done with that, tap the done button. Now here, go ahead and tap the next button, tap on add action and search here for assistive touch. So search for assistive touch and turn this into off just like that. Tap the next button, disable right here and tab done. Now you will need to create another one tap the plus button right here, create personal automation. Again, do the same thing for the app. So go to app here, choose the app. Again, you can choose whichever apps you want or all of them, or just specifically the apps for which you want to actually create custom icons. So let's go ahead and choose a few more here. Let's choose Instagram as well, because we will try out that one. Let's make sure we have also camera. We have all of these selected here and tap the dumb button. So tap next and then add action and search for number. It's simply a number. Just search for a number. It will show like this tap on there. It says 42 there. Don't need to touch that tap next, disable this and tap on don't ask and tap done and now you're good to go. So what you get right here is two automations, which will basically block the redirections and the banners that you get on your iOS 14 device. Now, of course, you can create shortcuts here to launch the apps and add the custom icon. So that's pretty simple. Once you create, you tap here, you just search like scripting, open app and just search for any app you want. So let's just try out app store here, tap the next button. And of course you add the name here and then you create that shortcut. Once you have created a shortcut for one of the apps, what you gotta do is just tap the three dots right there, tap the share button and tap add to home screen. Now from here, of course, you tap that little icon and choose the icon from the library of your iPhone. Once you choose the icon, tap choose right here. Now you can remove the label from here. It is very, very simple. You just simply tap that X button right there and just tap add. And now it will add this tab done here. It will add this to your home screen without actually a label. And you can see right here, if I tap it, it will open directly to Instagram, no banner, but it does show a notification. And that of course it is annoying. You can basically turn off notifications as well. Now here's what you need to do. Head on to the settings app. Once you're here, tap on screen time and then tap on see all activity. Now from here, what you need to do is just go ahead and swipe down to notifications. Now, if you don't see shortcuts here on notifications, or if you see shortcuts, but you can see it doesn't actually have an error that like these other ones do. So if I tap here, it will take me to the Facebook notifications. The one for the shortcuts doesn't have it. So what you need to do is tap on the arrow and go to another date where you can see shortcuts. And of course, it will show the arrow. So right here, you can see we just went like three or four days backwards, tap on shortcuts and disable notifications right there. Now this, if you reboot your device, 
these will turn on back again so you will need to do this every time you reboot your device you probably don't do it that often so that shouldn't be a problem so here we go now we have an icon of course here on the setup it doesn't have a label and if we open it no redirection and of course no banner which is really annoying and of course no notification as well so it is it is that simple doing this on ios 14. now for this i want to give a big shout out to iDevice movies for learning us about these tricks really awesome go ahead and watch his videos i will leave of course his link right down below in the description of the video so that's pretty much it for this video guys this is how this how simple it is to create a perfect setup on your ios 14 without redirections banners and notifications and labels as well so that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching and i will see you on the next one